Hey there, gamers. Welcome back to Joystick News. Today, we're diving deep into the chilling and exhilarating world of Resident Evil, focusing on what we might see in the highly anticipated Resident Evil 9. This franchise has given us countless sleepless nights, and the next installment promises to be no different. We've got some juicy leaks, rumors, and our own speculations to break down, so let's get started. Remember to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for all the latest updates on your favorite games. First up, let's talk about the setting. One of the most intriguing rumors suggests that Resident Evil 9 will take place on a fictional rural island in the Southeast Asia Sea inspired by the beautiful yet eerie landscapes of Singapore. Can you imagine navigating through dense jungles, exploring ancient ruins, and uncovering secrets in eerie coastal villages? The isolation of an island setting would add an intense layer of claustrophobia and helplessness which is perfect for the survival horror genre. The thought of being surrounded by water with no escape gives me chills already. How about you? What kind of environments do you hope to explore? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. Now let's dive into the characters and storyline. This is where it gets really exciting. According to some leaks, Chris Redfield will be returning as the main protagonist. But that's not all we might see some of our favorite classic characters making a comeback, including Claire, Jill, and Leon. After the dramatic and emotional conclusion of Resident Evil 8, Village and the Shadows of Rose DLC, there are so many loose ends and potential story arcs to explore. Will Rose Winters join Chris's Hound Wolf squad? The idea of Rose with her supernatural abilities teaming up with Chris is something I can't wait to see. And what about the Bisa using bioweapons? We need answers. The anticipation of seeing these characters again, especially in a storyline that might connect all these threads, is almost unbearable. Speaking of gameplay, there's a fascinating rumor that Resident Evil 9 might offer both third-person and first-person perspectives. This dual perspective could be a game changer, allowing players to choose how they want to experience the horror. Imagine switching between the up-close intensity of first-person view and the strategic overview of third-person. This flexibility could make the gameplay even more immersive and terrifying. Additionally, it seems Resident Evil 9 might incorporate more action elements similar to the Resident Evil 4 remake while still maintaining its core horror essence. What kind of gameplay mechanics are you hoping for? Personally, I'd love to see a mix of intense combat, stealth sections, and intricate puzzles. Let me know your thoughts. No Resident Evil game would be complete without its terrifying villains and enemies. With a new setting, we can expect new and horrifying creatures. Imagine mutated wildlife lurking in the jungles or ancient bioweapons hidden in the ruins ready to pounce at any moment. And of course, we need a new antagonist to haunt our nightmares. There's speculation about a cult or secret organization pulling the strings behind the scenes, which sounds incredibly intriguing. A villain with a complex backstory and a sinister agenda could really elevate the game's narrative. Who do you think the main villain will be? Share your theories in the comments. One of the hallmarks of the Resident Evil series is its intricate puzzles and exploration. An island setting could offer some of the most complex and engaging puzzles yet. Picture this, you're exploring an abandoned temple, deciphering ancient texts, and uncovering hidden passageways. These elements could provide a perfect balance of tension and intrigue, keeping players on the edge of their seats. I love the idea of puzzles that are deeply integrated into the environment and storyline, making every discovery feel rewarding and crucial to your survival. In conclusion, Resident Evil 9 promises to bring a lot of exciting changes and familiar thrills. Whether it's the new setting, the return of beloved characters, or innovative gameplay mechanics, there's so much to look forward to. The anticipation is real, and I can't wait to see what Capcom has in store for us. What are you most excited about? Let me know in the comments, and let's get the discussion going. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. Until next time, stay safe and keep gaming.